All right, I've been softening up this clay for the last several hours. And uh, now I'm going to start cutting it up. Because I was getting low on my clay. I've been trying to come up with some kind of an idea for a sculpture. A new piece. Something that has been sitting in the back of my mind, but hasn't quite come out yet. And that happens sometimes. But I thought I'd come down and at least get the clay started softening underneath the light so that I'd have a good supply ready to go. This is what I do is I cut the clay up into smaller pieces out of the 10 pound block of uh, this clay that I've got, which is a JMAC medium hard clay that I got from Sculpture Depot. And uh, got an idea forming them in my head. I want to do something that will clear my palette. I took this last week completely off. Haven't thought about a thing. I tried to at first, but sometimes it's best to clear your mind if you're blank. Time to play with some clay. mostly blank this last week <laughs> so I did other things and uh, I'm thinking about doing a bust I know it's 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 not something uh, that uh, it's hard to do for me. I just really enjoy doing faces. And I've got an idea forming in my head. And I've been going through uh, photographs of uh, faces and, and uh, stuff like that just to try to stimulate the uh, creative juices. see what it comes up. I will uh, probably start this tomorrow. I thought I'd get the clay prepared today and I might work on my armature that I'm thinking about using. All right, the last of the clay and I'm going to cut it up here. I've created quite a pile of clay. Just fine. Ah. The last one's always hard to cut. There we go. All right, I've got uh, aluminum wire that I bought off of uh, Amazon, and uh, I'm going to use this to uh, build my uh, armature. So anyway, I'll be right back as soon as I get uh, this to a point where what I'm going to do right now is something I cover in my uh, instructional videos on how to sculpt a uh, human bust or a bust. You can find a link to all a review of all my instructional videos down below this uh, video and uh, take a look and see if there's anything there that would interest you. But I'm not going to show you everything I'm doing right now because of the uh, fact that people pay to see that and I'm not going to give it away. All right, I've got the armature started. Wasn't going to do it today, but I figured what the heck, I've got nothing else to do this afternoon. And so I've been working out the proportions 
the head measurement is going to be about seven inches on just a little bit less than eight and a half inches uh this eight and a half is standard head length for a uh, human and uh let me get my ruler yeah it's six and a half inches so it's less than uh a uh full size or life size but uh it's still big enough for me to get some detail in <clears throat> the shoulders are going to be two heads wide because it's going to be a male and uh so i've subtracted for clay that's why you see it bent right there instead of way out there by the uh where the outside part of the shoulder should be and all i'm doing now is just working out the arm armatures I've never made an armature like this before, so this is the first time. Uh, what I've done is I've uh, brought wire, this aluminum wire, out in front of the, uh, well, in front of this post, which is going to be this main support. And I'm just going to bring the clay out here so that uh, the bronze will be thin in this area where the chest and all that stuff is. And... Uh, It'll just cut down on the uh, amount of bronze used in the uh, casting of this piece. And I'm working out right now the uh, length of the arm down to the uh, elbow. And uh, that should be about right there. And that's as far as I'm going to take it. Because uh, if I want to add to it, I will. But this will just give me something to uh, build my clay up on. I cover how to do all this and all the measurements and everything in uh, creating a bust of a human. Also in creating an armature for a uh, human in my uh, creating armatures from scratch. Now you can go to uh, Sculpture Depot. They've got uh, ready-made armatures uh, out of foam, uh, life-size if you want to uh, do a bust that big. And uh, they're not inexpensive but uh, at least they're there for you to use if you want to go that route all right I'm going to continue this uh, tomorrow but this at least gets this started and I'll uh, pick this up uh, manana good night everybody and I'll uh, see you then if you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel it really would help me also check out the link below this video it will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting good night everybody